it's back on the road for Michelle. This time, she's been called out to Dev Hurlbert's farm, where calving season is in full swing. 10 years ago, bought a couple cows and a bull, and now it's growing to where we have 20 cows. And because we started out as a hobby farm, we're fortunate in the fact that we can have a close and personal contact with our animals. Hello, how's it going? Good. Good, nice to see you again. So you've got a couple cows you want me to check? Yeah. What's going on with them? This one was acting like it was going to calve and then just kind of stopped. OK. I just thought I'd get some expert advice. A pregnant cow in prolonged or stalled labor could mean that the unborn calf is in trouble. If she's gone into labor and then now is showing no signs, the calf would definitely be in danger. Um, the calf could even be dead at this point. To determine what's really going on, Michelle has to get hands on by going all in. Well, let's give her a look. I'll get lubed up here. I can't just figure this out with my eyeballs. So I'm going to go in there, have a feel, bring the ultrasound, then I can actually have a look and see how the calf's doing. To keep from getting a hoof to the head during the exam, the pregnant cow is secured in a squeeze chute. You got it squeezed up? Yeah. OK. OK, I'm going in the back door. Let's see what we got there. OK, just hang on. I'm not seeing anything yet except for stuff. Just slip that in my hand. Cool. Yeah? Yeah. You see all that fluid in there, Dad? Mm-hmm. That's like. Uterus. Is that the head? So you can see him moving around. And so I know the calf's viable. OK, that's Thank good. You. Yep. She can go. The calf is healthy. It just isn't quite ready to leave the womb. It will be a few more days before this mom brings her baby into the world. Go forth and gestate. 